Richard R. Skemp defined two ways that mathematics may be taught and learnt, instrumentally or relationally. Skemp defined instrumental learning as the possession of a rule, and ability to use it. For example, area of a rectangle is length times width, borrowing in subtraction, and invert and multiply for division by a fraction, etc. Skemp defined relational learning as knowing both what to do and why. For example, understanding and explaining why area is measured in squares, understanding and explaining how additive place value is evident in subtraction, and understanding and explaining that division is multiplication by a fraction, etc. So what if the teacher is teaching instrumentally and the child wants to learn instrumentally? Short-term effect, all appears well, as there is a match between the teacher and child's goals. Teacher and child do mathematics. A child with instrumental understanding doesn't know if they are right until the teacher tells them. Long-term effect, child learns ever more rules, developing shallow understanding of mathematics concepts, causing problems when a question does not fit a rule. Child may continue to study mathematics but will drop mathematics as soon as they can. What if a teacher is teaching relationally, and a child wants to learn instrumentally? Short-term effect, initially there is frustration for the teacher, the child doesn't want to know why, and for the child, just tell me how to do it. Long-term effect, both the child and the teacher develop deep relational understanding of mathematics concepts and the relationships between concepts. The child continues to study mathematics and works in a mathematics-related career. What if a teacher is teaching instrumentally, and a child wants to learn relationally? Short-term effect, child tries to understand relationally that which is being taught instrumentally. Child tries to develop deep understanding but is being taught shallowly. Long-term effect, child feels that they are not smart enough to understand mathematics. Child disengages. Child drops mathematics as soon as they can. As a parent, they may either tell their child that they were not good at mathematics, or may worry about their child's mathematics, and try to help by teaching them instrumentally. What if a teacher is teaching relationally, and a child wants to learn relationally? Short-term effect, both the child and the teacher develop deep relational understanding of mathematics and the relationships between concepts. Both the child and teacher build their mathematical meta-language to explain why. Long-term effect, the child continues to study mathematics with deep relational understanding, works in a mathematics-related field, and saves the world.